households, both alike in dignity. In Fair Brookside, where we lay our scene. And in Brookside, dignity's all you got. I won't lie, I'm no good at it. I wasn't gonna do this case for them. I wasn't gonna do it for the gangsters because the only thing worse than a gangster that doesn't like you is one that does. I wasn't gonna do it for the dead kid because I never knew him. And I wasn't gonna do it for Tyson because I knew him and he was an asshole. Sure as hell wasn't gonna do it for her. That's a big book. It has a lot of pictures. Shakespeare. That for class? Not really. Can I help you find something? I was looking for you and I found you. <laughs> I thought maybe you wanted a book. You're mad at me. Not anymore. I found another lab partner. I'm not a good student, not like you. That's why I'm here. Tyson's in trouble. Spare me the details. You know how I worry. Last night, someone killed a Mexican kid who was hitting up the apartments. The banditos think that Tyson did it. Well, for everyone's sake, I hope he did. Because those guys don't miss. <sighs> Look, I'm not asking you because I think you should do it. I'm asking you because he's innocent and you're the only one who can. Will you take the case? I was gonna do it because I can't lie with a good goddamn. And if I can't, then no one can. And if there was one thing I knew right then and there, it was that someone was lying. Tyson's place is right there. Does this look like a setup or does this look like a setup? Maybe both. I didn't know the dead kid, but I knew his brother. Carlos ran the east side and kept the west side on the west side. The main difference between a west side killer and an east side bandito, besides the color of their skin and the color of their hoodies, was absolutely nothing. Tyson and Carlos's people would trade bullets until there were no more bullets or no more people. It didn't bother me that Amber had taken up with Tyson. What bothered me was that she seemed to really like him. So who's this guy? This is the guy I told you about, the student. You got a name, student? Socrates. And I have some questions for you. What you drinking, student? Coffee. So? So, the east side heir apparent is dead on your block. With a nine in the back of his head and one of your 45 slugs beside it. <laughs> and what makes it really funny is how you didn't do it. Damn right it wasn't me. Personally, I think me shooting him in the head getting a wet back heart attack, yo. Yeah, he must have been scared. But then again, it must have took a lot of balls to come on the west side alone. It's almost like you wanted to die. All I know is boy was the wrong color, in the wrong place at the right time, yo. You know, maybe you should sit down, your lady. Talk, I don't know, birds and the bees. She maintains this uh, girlish notion that 
her sweetheart isn't a murderer. Look, Urkel. I appreciate you coming out here with your cock out, your magnifying glass and shit, but this ain't your fight, homie. If it's a fight you want, or you're gonna get it. Your name's ringing out both sides of the boulevard. <laughs> Who am I supposed to be afraid of, the police? Fuck the police. They get a line up together by Christmas, I believe in Santa, but you, you drop the big man's little brother in peacetime for painting a picture on the wall? Come on. Carlos is doing his own investigation. You should see his magnifying glass. Could use a guy like you. Who couldn't? Yo, son, what you gonna find by the bathroom? Coffee goes right through me. Yo, everything be real simple. Boy knew what he was putting up when he stepped to the west side. At 3 a.m. in Brookside. Everything be real simple, yo. You know, I can't blame Amber. It's awfully cute the way you crinkle your nose when you're lying. Coffee. Can I get a lid? Yo, hold up a second. Hold up. He's not normally like that. Oh yeah, what's he like? He's not so tough. He was just fronting for his boys. That's not the real him. Sure you don't think he's the type of guy who should have today's kid to the eyeball? Because somebody told me he was. What? Who? Him. He, he's trying to protect me. Protect you? Why? Did you kill him? No. Then who did? I don't know, but I know it wasn't him. And somebody else does too. I don't know who she is. But he was with someone last night. Pick the right night to get restless. You don't understand. It wasn't the first time. You saw her? I heard her. I went to his house last night. He came out of the bathroom and I know there was somebody in it there. It could have been a radio, Amber. It was the radio until she turned it off. She probably just wanted to hear me cry. Okay, listen. Stay by your phone. Wait for my phone call tonight. I need the only honest person at Brookside on my team. You understand? Save the ink. I don't forget. Hey, just want you to know he ended it last night. He promised me. Did it go like this? As I saw it, Tyson was crossing the boulevard for one or two reasons. There was a taqueria so good he paid with his life, or there was someone on the east side who could save it. If Tyson ended it last night, that chica had a long walk home, and from the looks of things, without a sweatshirt. Timbuk's 
says you hit me. Ten bucks. All right, get the ten bucks. You gotta use your hands, huh? With your form, Esther. You don't play football, do you, little man? Since I was six, but I'm a little bit better with my glasses. Give it here, Holmes. You first. Little wise brother, we need to talk. About what, little man? Tyson. Save it for the eulogy. He falls tonight. Sorry, Holmes. Don't apologize. I never liked the guy anyway. But when there's a war going on, I have to take the long way home. You misunderstand, little man. This shit is between me and Tyson. He wants to stand behind his boys like a bitch. Their blood is on his hands. You walk over there like it's World War Three. And it will be. I can get you, Tyson. I just need a little time. You have business plans, maybe? For the killers? It's not my business. This is pleasure. Tyson has something in mind. What's it got, little man? Your contacts? My girl. Orale. Okay. So you want some time? That's 10 minutes. I'm afraid that's all I can give you. I'll get you, Tyson. Park off 10th Street, save a seat. He'll be riding shotgun by midnight. You remind me of Juanito. He loved books, beautiful things, Taking graffiti. long walks on the wrong side of town. He never should have been on the west side. He never should have been on the west side? He never should have been in Brookside, Holmes. He knew it. It tore him apart. He wasn't like us, any of us. That's why they killed him. Understand? Yeah, I understand. Find Benicio and the boys. Let's go. I think maybe you should leave. It's starting to get dark. People around here might think that you are black.
Meet me at the bridge. Tyson has a choice to make. He just doesn't know it yet. You don't have a cell phone? What's in a name? What that wish we call a rose by any other name, smell as sweet. What the fuck is Amber? Not here. It's just me. And our old friend Bill here. Did she bring me one of your library books? How to get up in everybody's shit by Mr. Fucking Student? <laughs> It's not mine. It's little ones. I thought you might want it. I don't. There's nothing your scrawny little Sherlock Holmes ass can do for me. For Amber, for any of us. You never should have left the library, motherfucker. A man ought to know where he don't belong. Prove, huh? I bet that ain't even little ones. I never said it was. You know, I don't know how you do it. I'm not much good at it myself, lying. But you, you had the bandits and the killers buying the Brooklyn Bridge. You almost had me. What I can't understand. How you got her? Miss Amber. Safe. What you tell her? Nothing. Not yet. But if I'm not out there by midnight, she'll read a story about two lovers whose stars were crossed. You don't have a fucking clue, do you? Actually, I have four. Your red sweatshirt and the black one at once. The graffiti on the bridge, poorly but admirably forged. Amber's proof of your innocence. The alleged mistress in the bathroom. Your alibi and your victim. He felt too hard for you, but you didn't give a good goddamn about him and you shot him. He was just a kid. You know where I met the boy? Church. As we speak, Carlos is crossing the boulevard, 10 men strong. But if you're out of here by midnight, this all ends. His words, not mine. I wonder all this is the truth. Because I can't lie. I'm no good at it. You walk out of here, you walk into your grave. But I take your story to mine. Straight down low. Tell a boy feel like a soldier, you hear? He didn't sit there and watch you paint the west side red. When did you kill her? Killed her the first day I met her.
to his house last night. He came out of the bathroom and I know there was somebody in he never there. Should have been in the West Side. I know it wasn't him. He never should have been in Brookside. Boys. Somebody else does too. He knew it. it. Tore him apart. Understand? You saw her. I heard it could have her. been the radio, Amber. It was the radio until she turned it off. He ended it last night. He promised me. He didn't sit there and watch you paint the west side of red. When did you kill her? Killed her the first day I met her. You don't have a fucking clue, do you? There's no such thing as a secret. There's only the truth and what used to be a lie. Hi there. Can I help you find something? No, thanks. I already found it. Summer reading for Mr. Cooper's English class. Hey, thanks. And thanks for trying. Hey, Amber. You were right about Tyson. He didn't do it. I know it doesn't matter, but who was she? Who was in the bathroom? And what I said before about being no good at lying, you're right. Doesn't matter. Well, that wasn't exactly true. Do you have pride and prejudice? Yeah. But who doesn't? How did you end up here? Everything seems so clear. Something you must have missed. Why are you laying there waiting for him to say something else? Nothing is left to say. All that is left is pain. Still you do nothing but lay and he swear that it's all a lie. How many tears to cry? How many times to wake to silent hostility posing a sleep that you thought would fix? All of the stones and sticks hurled at bones and bricks and figure this time would be different but clearly it's all the same. Didn't he call your name? Once it was that in the dream? Feels like a million years ago. What was it yesterday? What did he swear you say? Something about houses plague, pride and prejudice swaying a trial you're always on. You know it won't be long. How much can you be wrong before he realizes you're human and you got a heart of your own. Everything here is stone. Break it down to the bone. One day he'll wake up and you will be gone. This is hustler shit. No love lost. Just blood. No talk. Guns tossed. What's in the name? Keep it out your mouth. Swallow your tongue. What you talking about? What side is you on? The game don't wait. What set you claim? The same old state. And it's beef if you want, so jump, motherfucker. Jump, motherfucker. Jump, motherfucker.